Good day everyone. I am Brenda Paula M. Ramos, a grade 8 student from Mati National Comprehensive High School. Today, I will be explaining how to factor polynomials. Factoring polynomials. Polynomials? Yes, we will be factoring polynomials using greatest common monomial factor or better known as GCMF. For example, we are asked to write 6x plus 3x squared in factored form. So first, let us determine the number of terms of 6x plus 3x squared. Correct, it has two terms, 6x and 3x squared. And we will determine the GCF to numerical coefficients. To find the GCF or greatest common factor of the given terms, we will be following the process that is shown on the screen. As you can see on the table, I have used all of the possible factors of the coefficients 6 and 3, which are 1, 2, 3, and 6, and 1 and 3 respectively. Taking out the common factors, we are left with 1 and 3. Note that 1 cannot be a GCF of two given numbers that are prime numbers. Thus, giving us 3 as the GCF. Moving on, we will now determine the GCF of the variables. To determine the GCF of the variables, we simply have to find the term with the least exponent. So what term has the least exponent? Yes, x is the term with the least exponent. Thus, the GCF of the variables is x. To have our GCMF, Simply find the product of the GCF of the numerical coefficient and variables as shown in the screen. Hence, 3x is the GCMF of 6x and 3x squared. The next step is to find the other factor by dividing each term of the polynomial 6x plus 3x squared by the GCMF 3x. Following the given format, we will be dividing each term by the GCMF. After dividing the terms, we are left with 2 plus x. Then, we need to rewrite each term as a product. The last step is to write the complete factored form. 6x plus 3x squared equals 3x times the quantity of the sum of 2 plus x. Hoping that this video will be a great help to my fellow students. Till next time, and thank you for watching.